Alright guys, I'm just going to quickly go through Cora's combo system here, showing off basically for a new person what you can do. You've got two basic attacks, you've got a light attack, and you've got a heavy attack for each star. Light, heavy, light, heavy. Now the, hang on, that heavy was wrong. That's the heavy. Heavy, heavy. Anyway, you've got a light attack mash. Good old button bashing. We all love, all love. You can do it with every style. And Earth is quite short. That's it. No, I think I should have all those. Oh yeah, water. Water is very long range and is usually your long ability. Now your heavy attacks have specific purposes. This one can produce an AoE and the freeze it. This one fills the air and then kicks it at people. This one gets in on people really quickly. This Oops. And this one does a uh, well. If you just press it once, it does that. But you can mash it and do a AOE spin the air attack. Now, some other useful, interesting things to know about this combo system is that you can dodge offset. You see one, two. Uh, we'll do it there. <laughs> less less chance to miss. It. One, two, then sidekick. Punch, punch, sidekick. So, Oops, that's a button. Ah, uh, don't do that. There we go. So yeah, <clears throat> the other thing you can do is. All the combos have basic modifiers that you press the heavy attack in to change what you do. So in the middle of this one, you press the heavy attack in to start doing this air bicycle kick. So it's the same button you use to do this. For air, you do this dash forward thing, which is pretty cool. And if you get up to a certain point in air, you just make an uppercut. It's pretty neat. Three hits of water does a sort of Get over here! Scorpion's on a move. You can actually grab enemies and bring them back to you with it. And four hits, four, four, like four. Four presses of about two, three, four. Well, this is sort of a uh, gatling gun, ice sort of thing. So those are some of the basic things you can do. Oh yeah, air, two hits of air. Uh, so earth, sorry. We'll do an air or AOE. Knock people down, earthquake thing. And then three hits. This big old pimpin' earth attack. Which looks good. You also get air attacks. This is the light attack in air with earth. That's the heavy. The uh, heavy attack in air is like this, but it, you keep your small short combo variation. So that's all fairly basic and not not all that complicated. I uh, don't know if yeah you can block cancel things. And not really all that useful. Now, well, other than blocking, of course. Now, the interesting thing about this system is that if you switch mid combo, as long as you you can switch to the ender of a different combo. Best way to describe it would be to just do air and go one, two, three, four, five. So the fifth hit is the big whirly kick, right? One, two, three, four, five. So the fifth kick is that one. So I go. One, two, three, four. It's mini kick. So you can see. Air. One, two, three, thousand, four, thousand. It takes a little while. One, two, three, four. Ah, I did the wrong one. One, two, three, four. Comes out a lot quicker. About two seconds. Ah, press too many buttons. There we go. Now you can, uh, Mix up like earth. That kind of stuff. It's pretty useful. It doesn't work as well. Oh, you can also do. Yeah. So fire is kind of a getting in power. And you use it to build up if you want to do. Water is your long range power. Oops. And Earth is your big heavy attack. Player. Now, the other thing you might want to know about the system is that you can charge your moves, and when you do, you get slightly better attacks. Yes, do with it indeed. 
So this is charge two, and I've got big long nails, big long nails attacks. Your combos, she's faster here, as you can see. Notably faster. Oh, she's a bit slow. Oh, I am the fastest avatar in the universe, so she covers my range and stuff with her fire punches. But this one, she does whirly attacks on everything. So she does little AoE tornado things. And for water, I think the gloves just get bigger. Yeah, the gloves get bigger. She gets bigger gloves. Interesting things are that your dodge move with... Your dodge move with... Press twice, sorry. I'm pressing once. You press twice while dodging, you do a little kick with water. You press twice while dodging with this, you do nothing. You press twice with fire, you do like a fire f jump forward thing. And if you... This is pressing dodge twice, by the way. If you press dodge with air, you do a little air ball. And you can actually like, stand there and just chill out on your air ball. Ooh, air ball! Whee! Jump on the air ball. I like the air ball. I like the air ball. I use the air ball a lot. Screw walking. Yeah. I'm the avatar. Deal with it. Anyway. The full charge of these abilities is ridiculously strong. Uh, just look at that. I mean, look at the first, look at the first hit. Let alone all those bloody tornadoes. It went from a single attack to this is widescreen AOE thing. Yeah, still short range. Well, medium range. And then the size of these big old blobs of water, earth. You start actually punching like bits of. Your combo brings out two rocks, and then your kick brings them back in on the target and smashes them. And your fire becomes a incredibly devastating teleporty attack, which you can't see because there's no enemies to show you. I'll show you with you. Basically, you can just warp in and teleport on attacks. It'll actually go up ledges and things. It's pretty amazing. So this is your charge modifiers and your attacks. The interesting thing is about those combos that I told you before. They actually keep those those modifiers, so I can boom. suddenly bust down some whirly, whirly, whirly things at the end, or I can teleport in on people with, with fire, and then bust out a whole bunch of whirly balls, whirly winds and stuff like that. So it's a pretty interesting system, and I will just go show you guys fire teleporting attack before I start. Gotta make sure the temple is okay. Tenzin will blame me if something happens to it. Oh yeah. No, you can't get away from car. She is way too angry for you to get away. So you just teleport in on Can't stop me. I'm the avatar. <laughs> I don't even know what I just did, but that was great. I <laughs> just like warped in on that guy. So yeah, you could use it to teleport in and then you bust out this kind of stuff and be all awesome and stuff like that. So have fun with it.